The city of Fond du Lac is gearing up to celebrate Halloween on Sunday, a few days before the actual holiday next week. It's part of the city's mission to make the day safer after a girl was murdered 45 years ago. NBC 26's Ryan Curry spoke with Fond du Lac police on how to stay safe while trick-or-treating. Ever since nine-year-old Lisa Ann French was murdered on Halloween 45 years ago, Fond du Lac police say the holiday has never been the same. In 1973, French was out trick-or-treating by herself when she was abducted by Gerald Turner. Fond du Lac police now require trick-or-treating to be done on weekends from the daylight from 2.30 to 5.30. Police advise Fond du Lac residents to have kids go out with adult supervision or in groups, never by yourself. Police say they want people to enjoy the holiday but also stay safe. We spoke with a former Fond du Lac resident who lived there during the time of the murder. She says Halloween was changed for the entire city. But I very much remember when this little girl disappeared and it was just unheard of. This sort of thing did not happen in Fond du Lac ever. One of the big things is for parents to have talks with their kids if they're going to go out by themselves trick-or-treating. Uh, you know, parents need to know where their kids are going to be going in the neighborhood, set time limits as to how long they can be out, um, you know, and, you know, stay in contact. Assistant Chief Climb advises anyone to stay away from dark Halloween costumes, and he also wants kids to be vigilant while walking on the street during Halloween. Reporting in Fond du Lac, I'm Ryan Curry for NBC 26.